How can the study of entomology assist crime investigators? Let's ask our expert. Entomology can assist crime investigators by providing a, a huge range of variation against which you can uh, measure the passage of time. Flies are really good at finding corpses. Because of that, you can be pretty sure that the first flies to find it will be particular species, those species that are best at detecting the uh, early stage of decay. You can then look at the maggots that are produced from the eggs that are laid and uh, figure out how long it takes for that maggot to develop to the point where it is, go backwards and uh, say, well, this corpse has been here for about three and a half days. Flies themselves don't feed on flesh. Although they may take some of the moisture, they really don't feed on bodies. So the first uh, group of flies that comes in are other flies that lay eggs that will become predaceous maggots. And so uh, there are the maggots that eat the flesh, then there are the maggots that eat the maggots. And they, of course, come in a little bit later. They have little mouth hooks at the front that they use to scrape at the flesh. Not very appetizing at all. If it's been there for a long time, then it will probably not have that many uh, maggots in it anymore. So after the maggots come and go, then um, beetles that feed on dried things, those are the ones that uh, can use the remaining uh, nutritional resources that are there. When I was a professor in Berkeley, got involved in a case where there was a fire in a house and uh, uh, everything was badly burned and there was a, a body in the basement and it was uh, badly charred. But under the body were some maggots, some quite late stage maggots that would have taken four or five days to get to that stage. And by looking at those maggots, it was very easy to, de to determine that that body had been there before the fire was started. And therefore, foul play was suspected. And eventually, uh, somebody was actually convicted of murdering somebody and trying to cover up his tracks. Uh, by burning the house down. 